Microsleeps are extremely brief moments where your brain has entered into an unconscious state. They're your body's way of forcing you to rest and are nearly impossible to resist. These mini naps result from changes in hormones like adenosine and hypocretin, which cause your brain to essentially close up shop. To give you a sense of what microsleep feels like, focus on this image. In a moment, we're going to flash a quick frame of black, and then the picture will change slightly. See if you can spot the change. Ready? Here's the first picture again, and the changed image. Did you catch it this time? Did you notice the additional boat? This game mimics the tiny gaps in awareness you experience from a 50 millisecond microsleep. And it clearly demonstrates why microsleep is so dangerous. This was a game. But imagine if you were behind the wheel and that boat you didn't notice was an oncoming car. In fact, the number one cause of high severity crashes on the road is fatigue. A scary thought since most Americans aren't getting nearly enough rest. Research shows you should be getting at least seven to eight hours of sleep a night, but 40% of Americans get less than this, and it could be having a detrimental effect on your life. To find out if you're getting the right amount of sleep, you could visit your local sleep lab and get tested, or you could take this quick quiz. Is there a good chance you'll doze off if you sit down and read a book? How likely would it be for you to snooze if you were traveling in the passenger seat of a car for more than an hour? If you were to lie down and close your eyes in the middle of the afternoon, would you easily fall asleep? If you answered yes to at least two of these, there's a good chance you're sleep deprived and need to start catching up on more nighttime Z's.